huge welcome to our viewers from the Estadio Berra Rio, located here in Porto Alegre, Brazil, and home to SC Internacional. And our live game is Barcelona against Corinthians. I'm Peter Drury, and this is Jim Beglin. A delight to have him on board. Thanks for that, Peter. Hi, everyone. The excitement has really picked up now, and I'm eager for the action to start. As with a lot of finals, caution plays a big part in the opening stages, but an early goal can blow all that away, so I hope that we can um, create a, a, an attacking contest here, which, which obviously we want for this showpiece. Mathieu. And it's Maori. We sit high. Now it's Neymar. Pumps it upfield. Varela. Now the pass. Mathieu. Some excellent tackling here, and that one a perfect example. Tries a through ball, Neymar passes it through, firmly met, can he score? He's done very well to get to that. Oh, he made that look really easy, Peter, but I can assure you that wasn't a, a routine save, he had to be very switched on there. Well, that should set them on their way and get into a nice rhythm, the early signs are very encouraging now. Neymar battles to win it back. Zuniga gets it away. Iniesta. And it's Neymar. Neymar showed plenty of zest in getting to the ball, but couldn't quite sort it out. Plus needed to be better than that. And he knows it. We'll try from distance. Varela. Looks to slip it through. Who's going to make this theirs? Maori. Aim forward. forward now it's Varela and it's Shakiri. now it's Suniga Miguel Veloso comes forwards out to the left it goes oh, well intercepted really alert to the danger that's gone a long way up and away Varela. Let's put a stop to that. Neymar gets it back. Varela with the ball through. Nicely controlled. Defending was physical, no nonsense, and it had to be. Heading towards half time, and it is still scoreless. Strong challenge, but well within the laws. Neymar. 
needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. Zuniga. And it's Neymar. Shakiri. Zuniga. Mashal. Well, there's the whistle. The first half of the final has flown by. So we've had the first 45 minutes of the final, Jim. How's it looking for you? Barcelona have got themselves ahead, but against the run of play, they won't be too worried about the chance count, though, as long as they're more robust and, and tweak one or two problem areas, they should be OK. Interesting half, just missing goals, so don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil-nil. At least there's always a plus side to a scoreless half. Defences are doing what they should, and it's going to take good imagination to break the deadlock here. The shot's on! Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. They're committing a lot of men forward at the start of this second half. They know that this is an important time for them now. Zuniga. Come back to the keeper. Aimed long and direct. Looks like a good ball through. Chance! Danger averted for now. Mathieu. Neymar it over to the other flank for a moment you felt that was going somewhere but they'll have to go again Mathieu great challenge tries a through ball Zuniga that's a good block but at the expense of a corner They've played it short here's the cross smart save Mascherano gets good distance on it. This ball, who's going to get there? Is that a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Varela! It's in! Could that be the start of something big? Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out, never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. Well, certainly the big occasion and a very big opening goal to boost everyone's confidence here. And the defence can get it clear. Well, they are working very hard to get it wide now, Jim. Yeah, that's, that's true. And is that how you're seeing it? Yeah, I think they've decided to concentrate on, on working the flanks to help the production line. It's, uh, it's where the room is. He's made sure that that won't get through. Neymar is being picked on here. Yeah, and defensively, they're alive to his movement and, um, and stifling his threat, Peter. He's made certain that won't get through. Got a shot away! <laughs> Mascherano. 
fine defending there. It's a long forward pass. Belts one. Oh, bang on target. And that's exactly the type of adventure we want to see in a final two, Peter, and it's a pity it didn't cause the net to bulge. Varela with the ball through. He comes flying in! And the ball's come out! No, poor contact, nothing on the shot. Sessegnon, spoon forward. He's done well to tidy up the situation. Bonner. Keeps everyone guessing. Played into the middle. And back out it comes. Dashing forward at pace. Looking to force his way through. Shakiri. Looking to shoot. Oh, and that should have been two. Well, he's definitely kept the side in the game then. That's really good positioning. They could have doubled their lead there. Well, the referee's pulled play back and has booked him for the original offence. And however many surrounded him, that is what he can do. Well, I think that defence there thought they were in good position and they had him where they wanted, yet somehow he's worked the scoring position when it didn't see him on. It's really crafty business, that. Corinthians take a two-goal lead and things should be comfortable from here on in. Oh, that's neat. Mascherano tries to get it forward quickly. And he's there to cut it out. Sessegnon pumps it upfield. Almost nothing left on the clock here. Just a few moments from glory. Big chance here! Really smart interplay. Well, that was textbook stuff on the 1-2 there. Great link-up play. Difficult to deal with. Gets it back. Face to face with the keeper. And it's in the back of the net! With so little time left, grandstand finish! Well, from right in front of goal, there was no way he was going to miss. Yeah, and I think we may have had too many defenders ball-watching then because they just lost sight of the real danger. Well, it's an inspired substitution. Terrific move by the boss. Well, the instruction from the manager would have been go on and make yourself a nuisance and see if you can snatch a goal. Mission accomplished. Barcelona give themselves a chance of a fairy tale finish. He's off on a marauding run. Oh, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Has a pop! A oh, great save, real class. That wasn't the easiest of saves by any means, Peter, and I think his instincts were, well, they were just razor sharp. Passes it through. Has a hit! We've got a goal! We thought it was 
over. It's all square once more. Look, there just wasn't much of a gap to begin with, and to find it, I think it was a fine drive, and I don't think the keeper could have really planned for that. I think he's a bit unlucky in that instance. All square again into the dying minutes. Well, Bonner plays it out to the flank. Great run, this. He's covered quite a distance. Wonderful quick feet. Iniesta is long and forward. All square after 90 minutes. There will be extra time. Well, I don't think either manager can have any complaints, really, because nobody quite pushed for the winning goal, and it always lacked that spark. So to clarify, extra time will follow. Barcelona did fantastically well to force extra time, having been on the brink of defeat in normal time. In fact, you could say they're the better off of the two teams, at least psychologically. So what now? And he's there to hoof it away. Varela. Absolutely focused then on the defensive side of his game. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team really, your striker should be the first line of that defence and, and he's delivering. And Messi! Goal! Barcelona! They've done it! It was coming! They have their reward! <laughs> Finishing doesn't come simpler than that. Bang in front of goal. Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. Barcelona take the lead. Balls out on the left now. Still going. Where to next? Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. He can get that clear. Barcelona get it back again. Mathieu. Clearance and very necessary. Shot a goal! And that would have been game set and match. Oh, it should have been the clincher, Peter, and he'll be kicking himself for not taking the pressure off. Oh, he really wanted that. I would agree. Uh, it's tremendous play. He's full of belief and imagination and hard to contain. Reaction should have equalized. Oh, that's a huge save to pull off there. Those moments can have a big influence on a game, too. He's kept them in front. And it's been taken short. Good challenge. He just stood firm. Had a shot! Who's loose? Who's getting there? There's a goal! Once more they've done it! They just will not lie down! Oh, an absolute gem of a cross. It made the header simple. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. Time, extra time. 
Well, it may well be a case of who's got most to give now. Fitness levels look good, and it's not any less competitive. The whistle goes, we're off and running. So, time for a bit of smash and grab. Gets it back. Mesut Ozil tries a long pass towards the front. Great leap! No, he didn't quite meet it right. Yeah, not only do they hit fast on the counter-attack, Peter, but they show terrific effort and desire in, in getting forward in good numbers. it forward now the pass now here's the through ball goes for goal there it is and the comeback is complete with time and space aplenty he was never going to miss and that's what the game is all about. Find space and finish, but we have to credit the pass to, to pick him out. Corinthians go into the lead. I think this team shows great willpower and a wonderful never-say-die attitude. No other outfit can match them. They just keep going. Superb. It's a loose ball. He's looking to get there first. He's going to have to tune his rangefinder before the next one. Now the ball's come loose and the chase is on. What a rocket! That is special! Sumptuous finish, an absolute joy! What remarkable powers of recovery! Diego perhaps deserves a little bit of sympathy here because that's a goalkeeper's nightmare. It's, it's clear that the keeper was unsighted by his defence and by the time he picked up the flight of that, it was too late. This has become one superb game of football. Oh, I think the coach will really be annoyed with that. The players were still thinking about their goal and just got caught napping. Oh, he's found him in space. Oh, he did the hard part right, but fluffed the finish. Oh, the weight on the ball was just perfect then. If only they could have come up with a finish to match. It so nearly came off for him. It's tremendous play on his part, Peter, and he's proving to be a, a right handful throughout the game. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. And that's it. Nothing between them. It is penalties. What a fantastic tussle, Peter. I thought we'd get a mistake or two as players began to tire towards the end, but fear of defeat seems to just keep them going, and it's a case of uh, who wants to step up now. Pressure and nerve. After two inconclusive hours, it is penalties. So, the final act of the final. Messi shoulders the responsibility of the first kick. Puts them one up. Good penalty. Completely wrong footed the keeper. Adriano is next up. Cruelly done. One each. He just did what he was asked. So, the second man in line. Well, it's never easy to step up and take a penalty, but he slotted that home with authority. So, the second man in line. Oh, that was a great strike, he just gave the keeper absolutely no chance. The third man in the queue. Oh, the 
Goalkeeper has gone the right way, but can't keep it out. The third man in the queue. Keeper's read that beautifully. That's a lovely stop from the keeper. He's done his teammates proud with that one. It's in, too smart for the keeper. And the lead is two. So it's down to him to keep it alive. And scores to keep them alive. Yeah, it's a guessing game for the keeper and he guessed wrong. So this to seal it. He's buried it and he's won it. Simply the big day was their day. A day for them and their fans. A truly proud line in their history. So on to centre stage come the central characters, the individuals who, as a team, blended into champions, and this is their moment.